Here are the stages in the journey of the Israelites when they came out of Egypt by divisions under the leadership of Moses and Aaron. At the Lord's command, Moses recorded the stages in their journey. This is their journey by stages. The Israelites set out from Ramses on the 15th day of the first month, the day after the Passover. They marched out defiantly in full view of all the Egyptians who were burying all their firstborn, whom the Lord had struck down among them. For the Lord had brought judgment on their gods. The Israelites left Ramses and camped at Succoth. They left Succoth and camped at Etam on the edge of the desert. They left Etam, turned back to Pihu Hyred, to the east of Baal Zephon, and camped near Migdal. They left Pihu Hyred and passed through the sea into the desert, and when they had traveled for three days in the desert of Etam, they camped at Mara. They left Mara and went to Elam, where there were twelve springs and seventy palm trees, and they camped there. They left Elam and camped by the Red Sea. They left the Red Sea and camped in the desert of Sin. They left the desert of Sin and camped at Dafka. They left Dafka and camped at Elish. They left Elish and camped at Rephidim where there was no water for the people to drink. They left Rephidim and camped in the desert of Sinai. They left the desert of Sinai and camped at Kibroth Hatefa. They left Kibroth Hatefa and camped at Huzirath. They left Huzirath and camped at Ritma. They left Ritma and camped at Rimen Piris. They left Rimen Piris and camped at Libna. They left Libna and camped at Rissa. They left Rissa and camped at Kihuletha. They left Kihuletha and camped at Mount Shefer. They left Mount Shefer and camped at Hereda. They left Hereda and camped at Machilath. They left Machilath and camped at Tehath. They left Tehath and camped at Terah. They left Terah and camped at Mithka. They left Mithka and camped at Hashmona. They left Hashmona and camped at Mosirath. They left Mosirath and camped at Bene Jeokun. They left Bini Jeokun and camped at Horhagitgad. They left Horhagitgad and camped at Jothbatha. They left Jothbatha and camped at Abrona. They left Abrona and camped at Ezion Geber. They left Ezion Geber and camped at Kadesh in the desert of Zin. They left Kadesh and camped at Mount Hor on the border of Edom. At the Lord's command, Aaron, the priest, went up Mount Hor, where he died on the first day of the fifth month of the fortieth year after the Israelites came out of Egypt. Aaron was a hundred and twenty-three years old when he died on Mount Hor. The Canaanite king of Aaron, who lived in the Negev of Canaan, heard that the Israelites were coming. They left Mount Hor and camped at Zalmona. They left Zalmona and camped at Punin. They left Punin and camped at Oban. They left Oban and camped at Ayu Abarim on the border of Moab. They left Ayu Abarim and camped at Dibon Gad. They left Dibon Gad and camped at Alman Diblathaim. They left Alman Diblathaim and camped in the mountains of Abarim near Nebo. They left the mountains of Abarim and camped on the plains of Moab by the Jordan across from Jericho. There on the plains of Moab they camped along the Jordan from Beth Jeshimoth 
to Abel Shatim. On the plains of Moab by the Jordan, across from Jericho, the Lord said to Moses, Speak to the Israelites and say to them, When you cross the Jordan into Canaan, drive out all the inhabitants of the land before you. Destroy all their carved images and their cast idols and demolish all their high places. Take possession of the land and settle in it, for I have given you the land to possess. Distribute the land by lot, according to your clans. To a larger group, give a larger inheritance, and to a smaller group, a smaller one. Whatever falls to them by lot will be theirs. Distribute it according to your ancestral tribes. But if you do not drive out the inhabitants of the land, those you allow to remain will become barbs in your eyes and thorns in your sides. They will give you trouble in the land where you will live. And then I will do to you.